Hello YouTube and YouTube subscribers. This is part two of part one of Killstar unboxing, review, whatever. Um, I was kicked off on my phone um, probably because I was maybe too boring or like my phone just said we're just gonna drop this chick because we just don't like her anymore. But yeah, that sucked. So I'm making a new video um, here's the second part. So I received another box along with the black packaging that I received that I was complaining about not getting. I did the um, review on the Endora top and size large. And then I also did another uh, review on the... See, this is probably why my camera gave up on me because I can't remember anything. And then I did a review and tried this on, which is the Jaded Strap Top in Blood Tartan. So this is just a continuance of what you just saw. And if you're just picking up now, um, you might want to go back and watch the first part of the video so that... Um, you can know what's going on or not going on. So you want to see this stuff on, go back and click on part one. But I'm going to open this with you guys. Hopefully it doesn't kick me off. Um, if it does, I'll just have to keep on making videos in small segments. So we're opening this up together. And what I'm waiting in for here in in this box is going to be, I think like a cape-like item and also another shirt. Happy, happy Killstar. Stop it with it, stop it. Use nice tissue paper with logo on it. We need black tissue paper when we're opening up stuff, not cardboard. This is ugly, caca. No bueno. So, I have three more things in this box. Let's see what the invoice says. The invoice says, dark crescent hooded duster and an extra small. And then a bite tonight long sleeve top and a large in scarlet. And the, the duster is in scarlet too. Um, because... I found that some of their velvety items run small, so I took a chance and got a large. And Blood Vow Lace Dress in a large, and that might be way too small for me. Or, sorry, large for me. Um, but I need to accommodate for the boobies. So I got a discount price. The duster was $71.99. The Bite Tonight long sleeve top was $15.97 and the Blood Vow lace dress was $40.79 and the total was $133.90 um, plus tax. So um, yeah, if something doesn't fit, I can just close up the box and then like put this back in there and um, make a return. So let's see what this stuff's all about. This one is the Tonight Bite Tonight Long Sleeve Top in Blood. Um, I'm going to try to move quicker so that I don't get kicked off of my own phone camera. Now this is what I'm talking about here. This is gorgeous. Look at this. I'm going to put this tag inside so that you can see the beauty of it. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's thick and nice and lacy. And it's see-through throughout. And if, look, if I was looking at this, I would think that this is like a size small medium and a regular size. So I'm glad I got a large because I think my boobs will need the room. So I'm very pleased with this. Um, the sleeves end and three buttons. 
and they're kind of uh, flouncy sleeves. Okay, that's called a flounce sleeve. And then it's fitted at the waist, as you can see, at, it comes in real nice and, and gives shape to the body instead of just dropping down. When you have large breasts, the last thing you wanna do is wear shirts that are just like a t-shirt that drop down. You wanna have something that that reminds the body that you have a waist. So if this shirt just dropped down like this, I would look way heavier than I am. But because it tailors in, I can maintain my shape. So that's what these shirts do at Killstar. They just do an amazing job with just like highlighting a woman's curves or curvature or whatever you want to say. So moving on, um, this is beautiful so far. What I'm looking at is the Blood Vow Lace Dress. All right. Nothing smells weird like chemicals. Um, usually I'm like really sensitive about stuff like that, but so far everything that I've ordered from Killstar is like chemical smell free. And that's usually formaldehyde that they use. This dress is absolutely beautiful. Here's the sleeves. They're kind of like on a bias with lace. And you got the front lace up corset look, which you can adjust. You have a keyhole here for cleavage if you'd want. The shoulders are open, which is called a cold shoulder. And obviously both sides. And being five foot, this dress is right above the knee on me. So it fits right here. So if you're tall, it's going to be pretty short. And here's the back of it. The back has a zip closure. Okay, and mind you, this is a size large. So it's looking like a size medium. Um, and let's see what it says underneath there. Don't believe everything you think. Advice. So this is gorgeous. I do recommend this. And it has a really good heft to it, which means that it's a higher quality velvet or velveteen, nylon elastine, whatever. Here's the big one here. Here's the here's what I was looking for and waiting for. This is the dark decent hooded duster. Or is it decant? I'm not sure. It's spelled the same way as decent, so I have no idea, but I'm in love with the reds that Killstar comes out with. It's just so bright. Like I always say, it's just so bright and it's just so indicative of the Victorian era where everything was just so um, over opulent, you know, um, so this is an extra small. This was the only one left, so I had to go for it. It does have a hood, like little red riding hood. I'm sure people will mention something with that. I'm gonna hold it up real fast. All right. So this does look like it's gonna fit a little bit snug, but you never know because it has a corset back which can open, um, but this isn't gonna stretch at all. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna be able to zip this. It's very long. Um, it's past, past the floor, it foots on the floor. Um, for five feet tall, this is gonna be really long on me. Uh, the sleeves are like a Morticia sleeve. Um, they do have finger holes in them and that goes on your middle finger, right? Like that. So it would look like that, which is nice. These are built in so you don't have to buy the gloves online. Let's see what the pool looks like. 
and it's a cross. So Jesus just decided to come right in and join the crowd here. Why does he always have to ruin everything? Um, and it says Killstar on it. And that's a high quality piece. It's hev heavy, it has nice heft to it. It's not like a cheap piece of metal. So the zipper's interesting because it's like only about 10 inches long here. So to zip it up, that's your zipper for the whole entire outfit. So let's put this bad bitch on. I'm sorry that I can't show you the whole entire um, length of this. This does have really excellent stretch. Um, here's the sleeves. And I bought this specifically for my daughter's second birthday. I'm joking. I bought it because I wanted to wear it for like photography purposes. Um, here's the back. It's got a corset closure in the back to tighten up if you wanted to. Um, it does have lace panels in the back which is what I'm missing to show you. And this was the highlight of this particular garment that I really, really wanted. This is why I wanted it. Because I love Killstar Lace and I love their velvet. I can wear this down so that it just drapes down like this. But it is quite beautiful and comfortable. I would say that this runs true to size. So if you don't, if you have big boobs, uh, size up. Um, but if you are true, like if I didn't have my boobs, the extra small would still be a little small. Um, because really after having five kids, I mean, it's being a true extra small, it's kind of hard sometimes when you don't exercise. I don't exercise. So I would order this in a small. So a size zero, to two, I would order a size extra small. And then if you're like a size three to four to five, order a size small. And then if you're like a, like a size eight, that would be like a large. But it does have really good stretch. So if I really wanted to, I could probably get it over my boobs with the power of Jesus in my Jesus pool here, but I'm not going to attempt that because I don't want to break the zipper. Don't want to break the zipper. I repeat, I don't want to break the zipper. So can you see this item? Isn't it gorgeous? Here's the inner lining. I feel like I need to put the hood on to show you the whole effect. Gorgeous. Killstar, you nailed it. This is a beautiful, beautiful garment. I am like in love with this. Again, oh, they spelled it wrong on the tag, but on the invoice it's spelled right. Dark Descent Hooded duster. All right. Um, if you ever get a chance to buy this, whether it's in red or black, go for it. Grab it. This thing looks expensive. It feels expensive. It's got heft to it. It's not cheap looking at all. I wish they would put a pentagram on here instead of the, um, the cross, but that's my own opinion. Let's see if we can get a better look at this through my back mirror here. I have really dark lighting in my house, so that's just the way it goes. What do you say? All right, I'm going to the bathroom. 
I think you guys know that by now that this is the only place where I have light in the whole entire house. So there's the back of my head. And then... Oh, this is so hard to show you um, without... All right, I'm going to put you here for a second. Move my nasty brushes out of the way, and I'm going to... I'm going to take it off and I'm going to put it, I'm just going to, oh, I forgot to put my hands in those little things. Oh, look. So, like I said, it has built-in little hand things. How cool is that? How awesome is that? Don't you want this? I want it. And I already have it, but I want a black one. So I will do whatever I have to, to order the black one. And it's out of stock right now. And I'm not very happy about it. On a scale from one to 10, I rate this thing a 10. This is just gorgeous. My God, look at this. Ooh. Look at the movement on this. Can you imagine like filming in the middle of a winter day and just having like a blanket of white and then all of a sudden, you know, you're filming maybe a girl with long black hair wearing this in the middle of a, like a snow field with nothing there except maybe like a distant barn or something. Uh, here's the inner lining. And you can see the lace panels a lot better. What I'm noticing is that there are two pockets two functional pockets in this cloak. One, two. So you could actually wear this somewhere and keep something in your pockets, like God knows what. Maybe some medication, maybe just candy, maybe just something normal. But anyway, that concludes my Killstar review of these three beautiful items and I thank Killstar for <laughs> the black uh, packaging that you had sent me because I complained about it and thank you for your email. Thank you for your ability to scrape up another black bag somewhere um, and for everybody else my hair, I understand that it is completely disgusting and that my makeup looks terrible, but that's not the main focus here. Now that I just made you pay attention to like how bad my makeup and hair is, I kind of just ruined it for myself, didn't I? I did. So part one had this shirt in it, okay? So I said three items and you're like, no, you only did two items. But part one had the Milady lace up shirt in large because I had a previous review on the small and I didn't try it on, but this shirt is fitted. So you really have to pay attention to your measurements with the shirt. Again, I'll hold this up for you. So it looks like a small, or a small medium in a regular size, not juniors, but this would be a, a juniors large. There's a difference. So this fits my bust. It does, and it fits perfectly. And this is the only large I've ever ordered for myself in my whole entire life, but I'm not gonna shame myself for it. I mean, I have to buy clothes that fit, you know, and maybe the patterns from China where people are smaller. And it just has a really cool zip in the back. And it's just a gorgeous shirt. And again, the reds are stunning. And that's why I bought three red pieces. It just works. I don't think there's anyone that can look bad in red. I don't. I think it's that color that, you know, I've always been afraid of wearing, but I'm not gonna be afraid anymore, um, especially with Killstar because everything that I've bought from Killstar is a win. 
and um, I recommend all these products and uh, I'll list them in the description for you so that you don't have to like rewind this and listen to my voice like 500 times and see me because I mean I wouldn't want to see this hairstyle or my makeup like again if I didn't have to um, so you guys have a great day this was straightforward because I don't want to kick, be kicked off my phone again. So whatever you're doing in life, keep on going. If it's good, yeah, definitely keep on going. If it's bad, try to regulate yourself, maintain your health, and get some sleep. Practice self-care and buy Killstar stuff because it is the best store for people who have like this amazing aesthetic for fashion and darkness at the same time. It's just, I'm in awe with Killstar and I will keep on shopping with them. And I have been since like 2013, I believe, maybe 2014. So you guys, thank you for showing up. Subscribe to my channel if you like reviews or if you just want to hang out with me and I'll talk to you later.